back and we're ready to start painting. Now, I have a palette with red, orange, yellow, peach, purple, and brown. And what's gonna be different about this today is we are gonna be doing color mixing with our brush and we are not gonna rinse our brush at all. It's kind of fun to just see what colors are gonna turn out on our corn. So the first thing that you're gonna to wanna to do is always scoop your paint from the side, never scoop it from the middle. And you are gonna paint 10 corn kernels at least on each corn. Now you wanna do this because the corn colors um, yellow, you'll never be able to get it bright like that again. So you want to start out with bright yellow because as soon as you start mixing it, you're not gonna get that fun bright yellow again. And you're gonna wanna paint your corn kernels in a random fashion. Random means just here, there, everywhere. No type of pattern, no groups of colors, no lines of colors. You can paint more than 10, but you should at least paint 10 on each corn. And when I'm getting paint, it's I'm always scooping from my edge. I'm never scooping from the middle of my paint. Scooping from the edge will keep it clean. It's still gonna get dirty, but it'll keep it as clean as it can be. So the next thing I'm gonna do, I can pick any of these colors, but you're gonna wanna paint at least five with each color. So let's say I'm gonna try orange. Just take a scoop off the side and just start painting. And then go ahead and paint five on your other. You can do more than five, but you should do at least five, just so your brush kind of stays with the same color. I'm gonna move on to peach. And you're gonna notice I'm gonna get some color that looks like it's orange with mixed with the peach. You, you wanna see that color variation in there. That's where all the fun color mixing comes in. Now I'm gonna go to purple. And again, these don't have to be painted perfectly, but you know, you should try to go up to your edges. Don't just do this though, because that you're, you have to go right up to your edges as best you can. Okay, I'm going to move to brown now. And then I'll do red. And you're just gonna keep on painting and mixing your colors. Here, I'm gonna show you some things that I don't want you to do. I have had some kids that have done this, and then this, and then this, and they try to get a bunch of colors on their brush, and it all just turns one muddy mess, and then your paints are gonna start to get messy. So really, just pick one color, see what happens, paint five, then switch. Here's another thing that I don't want you to do. Please don't dip in the middle and just dip all your colors. Your brush is just gonna get really messy and it'll end up all your corn kernels will be exactly the same color. If that happens, just paint your colors away until your brush is pretty clean and just start over. Go back to just one set of colors for five. I'll go back to peach. Also, don't mix on your palette. Do your mixing on your corns. It turns out better. Okay, 
And then just take a moment to make sure that all of your corn is painted and it looks good. And wait for it to dry.